The EV industry is growing, but expensive batteries pose a problem. To make EVs cheaper and more efficient, CATL and BYD introduced a breakthrough, a sodium battery. This battery has the potential to revolutionize the EV market by being cheaper, lighter, and more efficient than current batteries. Stay tuned as we explore the new sodium battery and its production timeline, because China's new sodium battery has Elon Musk crapping in his pants. Let's dive in. But before we get started, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. Sodium batteries are an exciting alternative to lithium batteries in the world of electric vehicles. Sodium, abundant in comparison to lithium, is a readily available resource. Extracting sodium is easier and more sustainable than the laborious process of mining lithium, which has detrimental environmental consequences. Lithium mining emits significant amounts of carbon dioxide, contributing to climate change. It also introduces toxic chemicals that contaminate surrounding areas, including vital drinking water sources. Sodium, on the other hand, offers a cleaner extraction process. Furthermore, sodium ion batteries have distinct advantages in recycling and do not rely on rare earth elements that pose environmental concerns. Lithium and rare earth elements are subject to supply shortages and price volatility, hindering sustainable growth in the industry. The price of lithium hydroxide has skyrocketed by over 1,000% in just two years, while sodium hydroxide remains significantly more affordable. However, it's important to note that lithium ion batteries are renowned for their high energy density and performance, making them ideal for performance in long range Tesla models. While sodium batteries excel in terms of cost and environmental impact, further advancements are needed to match the energy density and performance of lithium batteries. One major concern with batteries is the risk of fires and explosions, which can occur in lithium ion batteries. To address this safety issue, CATL and BYD chose to develop sodium ion batteries. These batteries have a lower energy density of 160 kilowatt hours per kilogram, slightly lower than current lithium iron phosphate LFP batteries. However, they offer numerous advantages that make them revolutionary. Sodium ion batteries are not only cost-effective to manufacture, but also excel in low temperatures and possess enhanced safety features. CATL aims to surpass an impressive energy density of 200 watt hours per kilogram with its upcoming sodium ion batteries. Excitingly, these batteries are expected to enter mass production by 2023, marking a significant milestone in the energy storage field. CATL's first generation sodium ion cells are already affordable at $77 per kilowatt hour and the second generation cells are projected to cost an astonishingly low $40 per kilowatt hour. Initially, experts believed sodium ion batteries were suitable only for certain applications like energy storage and two-wheeled scooters. CATL shared this perspective and some analysts speculated it was a strategy to pressure lithium suppliers to lower prices. However, as sodium ion battery development progressed and lithium prices soared in 2022, the perception shifted. Sodium ion batteries showed potential as a viable alternative for electric vehicles, EVs. In November 2022, CATL confirmed their sodium ion batteries would indeed power future EVs. BYD also announced plans for mass production and introduced a sodium ion battery powered compact electric hatchback. At the recent Shanghai Auto Show, CATL revealed their sodium ion batteries would be used in the Cherry iCar, launching later this year. BYD announced mass production by the second half of 2023, starting with the Seagull. The Seagull, unveiled at the Shanghai Auto Show, offers three versions with pre-sale prices ranging from $11,450 to $14,000. While current models use lithium iron phosphate LFP batteries, the new versions will utilize BYD's innovative blade batteries with capacities of 30.08 and 38.88 kilowatt hours. The new models powered by sodium ion batteries offer exciting advantages over traditional lithium ion batteries. Sodium ion batteries are safer and more cost effective. 
However, they have lower energy density compared to lithium-ion batteries, making them less suitable for electric vehicles. Yet, this lower energy density is not a significant concern for grid-scale battery storage, as more sodium-ion batteries can be installed without requiring extra space. Interestingly, the shift toward sodium-ion batteries may increase China's dominance in battery manufacturing. Out of the 20 sodium battery factories planned or under construction globally, an astonishing 16 are located in China. This means that China will soon have almost 95% of the world's capacity to produce sodium batteries. This contrasts with the Inflation Reduction Act passed by Congress in 2022, which aimed to reduce China's dominance in the lithium-ion battery market. While China dominates lithium battery production, it faces a challenge in manufacturing sodium batteries due to a limited access to soda ash, a crucial ingredient. Surprisingly, the United States possesses over 90% of the world's soda ash reserves found beneath Wyoming's desert. The vast deposits have been mined for centuries to serve the American glass manufacturing industry. Now, the question arises, will the United States leverage this resource to become a major player in the emerging sodium-ion battery market? Sodium-ion batteries offer an exciting future for electric vehicles due to the remarkably low cost compared to lithium-ion batteries. Sodium costs only a fraction, about 2 to 3 percent of lithium, making these batteries incredibly affordable. This affordability could revolutionize the EV industry, paving the way for cheaper and more accessible electric cars. Lithium-ion batteries face performance degradation over time, while sodium-ion batteries are largely immune to this issue, offering better longevity and reliability. However, sodium-ion technology is still in its early stages, similar to where lithium-ion was a decade ago. This leaves room for improvement and refinement in the future, Factors like declining lithium prices and the impact of the Inflation Reduction Act could shape the landscape. The United States holds an advantage with its vast soda ash reserves, but China leads in research and development for sodium ion technology. The question arises, will the U.S. seize the opportunity to become a leader in the sodium ion batteries, reducing reliance on China for battery production, or fall behind in the race for clean energy's next big breakthrough? Time will tell, but the battery industry's future promises an intriguing, dynamic, and competitive landscape. So guys, that was it for this video. What did you think about our video? Let us know in the comments section below. If you are new to our channel, be sure to subscribe and ring that notification bell to get notified about our latest videos. Thanks for watching.